That Mr. Jefferson bitch. Oh no, we not letting this get away with that. Hey bro, y'all fuck with these? Little Monsell. <laughs> Little Monsell. I've been eating hot chips every day. Hot chips and hot oh, chips and hot chips. Bro, I be pouring like seven packets of these bitches into each bag. Like, bro, I kept pressing my luck till one morning. It, it added up. It added up. That's all I'm gonna say. It added up. That nigga shit himself. Did I learn my lesson? F no. I kept going. Also, Cosmo, Wanda, you're not slick. And look, bro, the store is open. The link is down below right now. That would mean a lot to me if you could actually cop something. Because you, as you know, I do these videos for free, damn near. I do it out of love. Love don't pay bills. So in order for things to continue running, that is how things continue running. Like, Trav, you gonna ask me to buy something? You can't even look me in the eyes. You got shades on. You can't even look me in the eye. Yes, I can. That's not true. I could look at you. I'm gonna let you know right now, man. Like, if you don't cop something, I'm finna cop a casket. Look, we got a PlayStation shirt because it's a gaming channel. So I thought you would you would kind of. But really, a lot of my my effort and my passion is going into this. This is something I'm taking very seriously and I want to continue to grow. And it is in an effort to be able to continue to create content for y'all, for those of you that do enjoy it. So if you can and you want to, like, I'm not about to beg or no shit like that, but like. Yeah. Episode five, polarize. <laughs> hey, now nah, why is somebody tell me when I play games, it feel like DLC? <laughs> he said it feel like DLC. Watching this feel like the, I feel like the DLC or something. I'm like, damn, it's that bad? Shut up, bro. Shut up. Shut up. You know, another free video for y'all. Y'all like, man, just turn off the copyright. It's too late. We on the last one. You might as well commit, right? No money. I'm gonna get no money. Hey, bro, I also, before we get into this, maybe I should just start it, but I feel like as soon as we start it, it's gonna be serious, so I gotta talk to you real quick. This year has been so much. That's the end of the sentence. It's just so much. They say pressure make you stronger, but like, I, what? I might, I must have some different kind of pressure because why I feel weaker? <laughs> I know I'm not, I'm gonna hate myself when I go to edit this. Like, what, why don't you ever just shut the fuck up? You know what's crazy, bro? Cause they say like your car always starts fing up or doing something whenever life's going good. In this case, my car just said, oh no, I just want a piece of the action too. How's y'all year been so far? Like, I genuinely wanna know. Like, I'm for real. If you feel like sharing that with me, um, let me know in the comments. I really do wanna know. Cause me, honestly, things are good. I'm blessed. I can't complain. Financially, it has been heavy as hell though. These, the, these last two months, so heavy. So I got to lock in. <laughs> uh, Where am I at? Oh, is this that little room in the barn at the bottom? So this is going to be Max probably waking up. Chloe's dead, bruh. Like, I don't think I understand that. Also, the audio might not be loud enough. We'll see. I hope this episode doesn't hold me, bro. Please, please, please just act right. Please act right. Nigga said. I'm so paranoid every time I hear different music. Or when I hear the music, I'll be feeling like, am I? Is it doing that shit again? What was I about to say though? Uh, I forgot. Come on, Max, wake up. Wake up, sleepy head. Come on. Nah, I really want to know what I was about to say. Oh, this is me. This me. Oh, no, it's not. I lied. Oh, it is? Chloe? Yeah. What? Where? Oh, it's a dark room. The dark room. Yeah. Is anybody out there? Please help. I never think that's a good idea. Uh, 
Did, did, wait Finally, a minute. I'm free. Did this nigga... Uh, Almost. Did he strap me down with scotch tape? Nigga used that weak ass tape on me like I'm a piece of paper. Like he was just putting a little piece of paper on the on the uh, <laughs> on the wall or something. That was minimum effort. Mm, uh, I'm free. Oh, I can't detach the rest. Pull syringe. I don't know Max, what we look. Okay. You have to find a way out of here. Air Hardy shoes going crazy. That nigga said, D you make the game feel like DLC." <laughs> you funny as fuck for that. God, I don't remember anything that happened. I do. I don't know what happened in between those. This but. must be the same drug Nathan used on. I hate looking at myself like that. That's me. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. It's Max. Focus. Oh, we about to. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. How does this make sense? We gonna go back to being incapacitated? What the fuck is this gonna do? I, I'm gonna I'm shut my bitch ass up. I did it. I did it. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. Oh, Christ. Look at that perfect face. You weird bitch. Hold that stare there! Stay still! Sick fuck. Oh, I want to do him in the worst way. Please let me do him in the worst way. Oh, Max! You fucked up my shot! But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now. Why are you talking like I that? I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes. Nigga, nigga, one of those anime people. <laughs> he that kind of anime but watcher. I love. The purity of your own image. Bro changed his voice like to Rachel, who to fit his villain. He's always looking in the wrong places. His villainous ex uh, persona. Oh, who Max? Like nigga, just talk regular. Let me try this angle. Just talk regular. You're a sick fuck. No matter what the voice is. You gonna stand over me? Don't move. Am I supposed to be? Okay, no, right? Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could... I think it's a little too loud. ...see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Oh, good. Oh. Those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24 7 surveillance. Hey, if I'm not. So all I had to do if I'm not talking, it's because I'm really trying to. And you fell right into my hands. Pay attention. You really should have focused on schoolwork. Like I'm not good decisions. Detecting with your little friend. Not DLC decision. Chloe. <laughs> Chloe. Right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed... That Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will so, be So, yeah, I know she's dead, but like... Or care. Though I promise, people will care when we you... Gotta, we gotta... We have to figure out a way to... I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Because she for sure took okay. that shit to the dome ski. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Nigga got in sniper position. I'm not playing this. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. <laughs> Now don't move or this will hurt much. Them jeans suck, nigga. Stupid bitch! Them little booty pockets. You just don't listen, do you? 
little miniature in booty fact, pockets. You never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Oh, don't be like that, nigga. Always take the shot. Uh, see, now I feel stupid for saying that. I've been saying always take the shot in a couple episodes. I'll never say that again. I'm gonna put a jutsu on myself. If I say that again, I'm gonna e erupt in flames. Spontaneously combust. That motherfucker said fatal error. Are you back? Please, 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 please. Don't do this to me. Please. We here. So that changed to. Okay, I fucked this shit up. I fucked it. I fucked it up. Cool. We got oh, Jesus. I can't believe that happened. So sick. It's disgusting. So what's the plan, bro? What was the point of that? Oh, he moved some shit around on his desk. There's more photos. There's more. F okay. Oh, okay. I see what happened. He moved the folder down below and the photos were be beneath it. Wait. Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos. Good. Got you. Now I can use them. Got you. Got you. Got you. Uh. Okay. Whoa. I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. Still a crazy position, though. Like, I don't know. This might work. Please work. We gotta go back to, like, 1996. So, can she only do this with herself? I wonder if she could do this with pictures she's not in. That shit sound dangerous. Nigga like me, I'm going everywhere. <laughs> this can't be. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. There has to be yes, bad consequences Victoria to doing this so much. Victoria would kill to be in your place, but if she doesn't understand our connection. We ain't got no connection, nigga. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. Right. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all. Have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray. That's literally just psychopathic because I'm trying to think like cynical. what would lead to they this? Nothing. You're just a psychopath. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and the wires is fucked up. With them, like the screws is loose. And That's those it. lucky few become my models. My subjects. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Oh, uh, talk about it. Au contraire, Max. What are we gonna I'm do so though? Scared. We strapped down, Nobody Max. Knows what's happening to you right Talking now. a lot of shit. We 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 locked and down, don't get Max. Me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. You kill Chloe, go to hell. He knows. He knows he killed her. We gotta let that nigga know where he going. Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh, I don't believe in that bullshit. She okay. could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse. Blah, blah, blah. God, ah! your voice now. <laughs> you I like that. Well I like that. It, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. 
I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. How am I gonna get out of this? You use Nathan, he's as sick as you. He's as sick as you. Don't judge people, Max. He had to be a but certain level of sick to be used in the first well. place. You know what I mean? Uh, don't judge people. Uh... Oh, you too. That makes two of you. I hope Nathan realizes vision. So few people get that chance. You brainwashed him. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious darkroom and equipment? How else Fast could book? I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? EBT. Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Oh, what? I mean, I, we already initially thought it was Nathan, but it wasn't supposed to happen like that. He lying. This nigga lying. So you're telling me bro wasn't killing nobody. That was an accident, but since we're on to him, he's killing us. Why, Rachel? I don't have time to tell you everything. But she was special. A human chameleon, so many visual possibilities we had a real connection we're gonna pin frank on it fuck nigga too but chloe's dead so uh shit she let you take pictures did you know frank hey man fuck a nigga nigga frank did she let you take pictures of her rachel was in love with me that's not my ego just look at our sessions not that i'll let you nobody loved having their picture taken more bro groomed anyway. her Rachel is dead. On a very high level. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. Me and I my cared more about Nathan than you. That was Warren. No, <laughs> you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic. Also, what who I did what first? And subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. What? After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? Damn! I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. Yeah! Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I love when I they do love your bro, spirit, uh, Max, but you I love when the fucking MC start acting like this. Choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. MC means okay. main character. I'm now, sure you knew that, but let's see how these shots came out. Or motorcycle club. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your workout. I'll be watching Sons of Anarchy. I got like a season left. This is Sade? Hold on, nigga. This is kind of a vibe. Pretty personified. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Max. Okay. I wish you could see yourself now. What's up, bro? I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, rewind. Got you. Let's see how these shots came out. Wait. Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max. I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. You... you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. 
There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot. Dumbass nigga! You can yeah. do so much better. Yeah. This is exactly what I wanted. You don't understand that, Mr. Jefferson? Mr. Bitch Niggason? I'll take the copyright, fuck it. Oh no, this one. Shut up. This you ruined the song. Like, what are you talking for? Shut up. That looked like Taylor Swift Max. right there. Speaking of, bro, that was some bullshit. That was some bullshit. I don't even want to talk about the Super Bowl. The 49ers is my second team, if you didn't know. I got Bay Area and Blood in me. Arian is crazy as fuck. I just picked the Eagles because I felt like it. <laughs> nah, I just. I used to just love that nigga. Uh, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and Brian Dawkins. capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh. Anyways, I believe Max has taken what you kids Damn, call. Damn, we went all the way to episode selfie. one. A dumb word. I'm back. For a wonderful photographic trip. Right back where I started this insane That's week, good. and nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever the again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry. I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first the Dargar the Targaryen the Dargaryen? I said Targaryen. What? Game of Thrones? The Dargaryen? Who cares? Oh, I want to say who cares, but we got to keep it. The Daguerrean process. Oh. Well, that was easy, Max. Was it? Okay. Well, uh, okay then. So, uh, the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely what are you popular. At? Mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Obviously, Max has read them. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, Arctic. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. Damn, so what are we going to do? I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Okay, so... Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody has All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer. I hope I still love photography when this is done. Don't... I, just... I should be able to track down David's number from this... Found you. You did? Oh, right there, okay. Yeah, 555-630-8243. Oh. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. I feel like we should go Zebra ourselves. No, I don't like this text shit. But also, we probably don't have a lot of time because it don't he even look like we can go outside context, of this room. Asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco, and Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Yikes. Now that's Am crazy. I pushing myself too hard. That reminds me of like y'all ever have. I feel like I've asked you this. It doesn't ever matter what happens to me. I have to save Chloe. Y'all ever have dreams where you having a dream? Like you ever fall asleep in your sleep? You ever fall asleep in your dream? That happens to me. Oh, Victoria. My phone is dead and I'm bored we trying to bust out friends. my my nosy. Why did I give up the word for the image? Because I suck. But Mark Jefferson rules. Everybody in here loves him, but he only seems to care about Max. Call okay. Okay. See, I never read that in the first episode. Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to this. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? I can see you're kissing ass again. Oh. Nothing new. Oh. What did you just say? Hold on, Victoria. 
Are you okay, Max? Not until Victoria knows that hiding behind a screen and posting videos of people is totally fucked up. You know how easy it is to hurt somebody? To destroy their life? Are you proud of yourself? If you have any feelings left, you should think about your actions. Listen. Period. I, I didn't. Of course you did. You're so insecure, Ooh. you can't even be happy with your own town. Ooh. You have to try and bring everybody down to your mean and ugly level. Okay. I do Max not has have had to enough. listen to this bullshit. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? Well, it looks like you already did, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. I sure hope so. Hey, I'm not going to say I didn't enjoy that, but why? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No. That nigga think it he wasn't has, easy at you all. You think he the staples button? Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means all we know. a lot to me. We know. And Blackwell. The, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. Oh, we gonna have your ass getting in prison. Innocent. Or Ooh. guilty. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, they gonna be taking sweet little pictures of you. For the they gonna tell you, be, they gonna be telling you, toot that maybe ass up, boy. Toot that ass Francisco up, Mr. Friday. Jefferson. Or maybe only one of us will be They gonna be oiling this Don't nigga so down. Modest, Max. <laughs> Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. Okay, talk that shit. He probably like, what? He probably nervous as fuck. Like, what you know about me, bruh? Because nobody knows I could do this but Chloe. Okay, so Chloe's... Okay, nothing changed. Nothing changed. Something... Oh, it's a raid. It's a party. It's a party. It's a party. They cut okay. And Nathan. Oh, okay, they found Rachel. Okay, I'm like, what? She She did it. I won, of course. Who else? Who else? Chloe, baby, she's packed. Bestie back. Bestie back. Bestie's back. Taxi, where am I going? I'm still going to San Fran Whoa. to go visit the fucking losers of the Super Bowl. Pack West, bro. Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. I want to They go to that freaky glizzy. Who the fuck? Oh. I, I hope I did everything right this time. I'd have been tripping if I came to on a plane. If I came back to present day on a plane, I'd have. Good work, local David. teacher arrested. Nice. Oh. Nah, the principal going with me is kind of like weird. It's kind of random, right? Or I'm tripping. Chloe. Oh, you're alive. Oh, you're alive. I did it. I fixed everything. Well, sir. Like, she's technically an adult, but even when it was Mr. Jefferson, before we even knew everything, I always felt like that uh, male and female solo trip. Was Ravel strange? Be careful. I'm still between Ray. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. How the hell Aww, I, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Hot Dog. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time <laughs> when we were innocent. We still are. Is that Van Gogh? What? It's so weird to be in between realities. 
Hey, be honest, bro. Everything bruh. is out of focus. Be honest, bro. Y'all be turning y'all phone off on, on the on the plane. Sir. Be honest. I thought that was Chloe's little sister or something. I can't wait to land in Frisco. Uh, nobody calls it Frisco, so please don't. <laughs> please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Oh, I don't think Damn. so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. <laughs> Nigga woke up and said, Aah! How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Black. The whole fucking aisle stinks so now. I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get I'm surprised it. his lips didn't dry out. That's a smart way of telling me to stop. You know him. Working. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco. Oh, not at all. But we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. Christ, another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. I'm lost now. Like, which one is reality? Where, where are we for real? Because if we went back in time, how did... I don't... Man... Zeitgeist Galleries, Everyday Heroes. And now a cyborg? Got a little fit on. San Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I'll ever have caviar. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Work the room. I've had it once on. I don't know. I'm I feel so weird. Like, Extremely I'm overrated. A little kid hanging and with the disgusting adults. and salty. Max, after this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by. I your think rich niggas just like torturing themselves. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. To feel something. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm going to eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. There's a million other... But you come oh, talk no. to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Wowzer, Max. You did it. Oh, this ass serious. He ran up there. I went from the dark room to this gallery. What y'all? Oh. I've been through so many realities in one week. Hey, y'all know me, bro. Life is. I got a. Weird. <clears throat> hey, I got a. I got a picture over here, man. I won my contest at my school and shit. You know, uh, you know me, bro. I'm, I'm kind of famous in here. Are you Max Coffee? Oh shit! Oh Bravo shit! On your entry. I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. Why are you telling her that? I'll send you the details this week, if that's okay. Congratulations for your piece. That's not Max. 
Uh, How do these galleries afford to rent here? Who are you talking to? God, I love art. Cool. I wonder if I can buy these everyday heroes pictures. Sorry, I don't know your name, but I saw your picture in the gallery brochure, and uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. Thank you. That's all I wanted. Gas me up. That is different. Loving the retro vibe. Me too. Makes me want to go buy an instant camera. Damn, I bet that film costs a fortune. Why that nigga talking like that? Bro talking like his voice just cracked and he's compensating Here for it. Max Caulfield. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see me? Look, I could give you the real... Move! I can give you a live performance. Y'all want a live report? Look, watch. Look, look. God, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Shit, cool. Hey, and there she is to save the day. She loving Hi. this. Is that Rhett and Link? I know that's two different you people. Did it, Max. I don't know which one he You're is, a though. Real artist. At least for today. Oh shit. Wait. Oh yeah, what's up with the tornado? Damn, it all comes down to this. Chloe! Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. Who voiced him? High bro? altitude. Damn. Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. Who we call? Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's true. You, you saw the tornado. It's coming. What? Oh, no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm Chloe, stuck. can you hear me? Hello? Damn. Hello? Oh, my God. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is gonna be destroyed. I fuck with this. There I fuck with this. Stop this. I know it's a catastrophe going on right now, but I fuck with this. I dead ass would put this in the crib. This no shit. fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. Yeah, this shit gonna be called long nigga stepping. Stepping ass long nigga. This shit called ready set go. I like that. Look at this print. Depth of field, the colors. Look at the focus. Look at the colors. The polka. Horny ass nigga, bruh. Hey, somebody check that nigga history. Please, no. I, I have to be in Arcadia Bay to help Chloe. Not here. Oh, 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 oh. These galleries afford my fault, here. my fault, my fault, my fault. My dumb ass. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you. Shut the fuck up, what? nigga! Move! Sorry, but... Oh shit! Oh my head! <sighs> I know this what is something. going on now? It feels like reality is breaking apart. It ain't felt like that since day one. What am I doing to time? We stuck, bruh. I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. One simple change. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. So we end up ripping it again. Instead of the bathroom, it's okay. So who wins? Uh, Victoria. Oh, yeah. Yeah, true fucker. Care about her. Burning my picture. Wait. Oh. What the fuck? Oh. 
I am confuzzled, bruh. Everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. Is this that DLC like shit y'all talking about? Am I? Am I? Is this still supposed to be happening? Look at them little ass pockets, man. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, this nigga, Mr. Jefferson, got apple bottom jeans on. <laughs> Bro, got Echo Red pockets, like. What you doing with them little booty ass pockets? You a you a grown man. Whatever. Answer my question, please. Eat shit and die, nigga, for real. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die. A nosebleed is a first world problem. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, oh, but you, you destroyed your own beautiful photo. You're trying to talk all artsy and what a waste. poetic. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck, he you burned my diary. Always That's why I'm still diary. here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero. Damn, so I can't even rewind from here because this is where it started. Weird going on with you. Tornado. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Oh yeah, it's still two moons outside. Like I said. Something weird. But damn, Chloe's dead now. Again. There's that feeling. It's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Man, I miss Ellie. Ellie wouldn't have went for this shit. Ellie not going don't for this shit. This. Clem, Clem not going for this shit. Why can't we just kind of like simply just go and get up. We already seen what our foot did. I promise. Hell no, move! This final dose won't hurt. Hey, nigga! <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. <sighs> yeah, break them shits. Please, don't do this. Hey, what am I supposed to be doing? I promise this final dose won't hurt. Kick that nigga, bro. I'm gonna die. What? Oh, see. Bro, grab the tribe. Damn! <laughs> This nigga sucks. No, David, no. 
I'm gonna warn him. I'm probably gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna warn that nigga. How was you in the military, bro? Like, no, bro. No, bro. This nigga walked in like this. I would not want to be in the trenches with his ass. I wouldn't even play Call of Duty with this nigga, bro. Come on now. You supposed to check Pete. Check Pete, Nick. Pete, check. So and I promise you. Now. No more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I, can I please ask you for one last request? Oh, you got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Turn off the lights. Some water. Play some music. One last picture. Would you uh, take one last picture of me? I, I want to be your best subject. I feel like this would... I almost don't believe that, but... I think you finally learned from me. I knew that would be the one to get him. Look at them little ass pockets! That's really bothering me. <laughs> I got an achievement. I achieved shit. I promise this final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Bro, he is so ass still. <sighs> Get the camera next to you! No gun, no balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. Get out of here, bro. Come on now, bro. This nigga sucks. Bro, let him run across the room like a badass six-year-old. <laughs> Sorry, bro. What was you doing in the in the military, bro? David Matson, of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. Hell no! You about to shoot me? <laughs> Don't shoot me! Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. <laughs> Come on, man. What, what the fuck is wrong with this, bruh? You are not going to stop. Grab your gun now. Got I it. Didn't, I didn't see that. Oh, cry. Why is this nigga taking orders from me? He talking about some got it. So you waiting on me. It's kind of funny, though. Now stop me. I ain't gonna lie. I let, him get, I let him get shot a few times for snitching on me. I'm never gonna forget what he did in that office, bruh. Ever. So... Now that we got that out of the way, it's over. Let's do the real you thing. You are not going to stop me. David, kick that table. Yes, sir. <clears throat> oh, okay. My fault. My fault. My fault. My Jefferson, fault. My fault. It's He's over. hiding a gun over there. <laughs> Sorry, Madsen. This is it. This is it right here. This is it. This is it. Oh, Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Are you okay? Yes. Are you all right? Thank you, David. She... Uh, Max got the ick. She icked out. She like, this nigga, sorry. He's a little, little beta boy. <laughs> I'm going to chill on him because at least he had the courage to do this and, and pull up by himself. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. He just don't got the whole package. Let's yes. wrap up this son of a bitch first. Now stomp him out. <gasps> he won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Yar. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. 
save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Yeah, what what are we doing about that? Warren! Yes! I, I can use that picture he took of us. At the party. But then we're going oh my shit, no signal. I need to borrow your keys. Let's Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. Okay, yes. But you won't need this anymore. The Prescott's had to know about this. I better go outside and call Warren. Is this? Oh, no, 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 my fault. Is this the, look, did he shoot this? You see the symbolism? That's Chloe, bro. I'm just making shit up. My fault. What the hell is this place? I don't know, I gotta go, man. Hold on, Max. So, where is Chloe? She's dead. Oh. Oh, see, cause I, I'm, mm, I, f <sighs> hold on, I'm really trying to think like what's going to be, can I rewind? If I tell the truth, that shit's probably going to, let me tap into my, into my movie, into my movie mind. If I tell the truth, he's going to get belligerent and probably, I don't know if, if kill him. Well, he going to fuck him up, which I want to see really bad. But if he kills him, then Jefferson's getting off kind of easy. If I hide it, then it's business as usual. He's supposed to be going to jail. I don't even know if any of this matters anyways, if I'm being honest. Him going to jail is, is the worst option of the two. I'm going to hide it. David, um, well, she was pretty stressed out. So um, she went to go um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air and use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. You're brave so I rewind? I want to see I'm what the other one Chloe is. Chloe has a best friend like you. Go on now. You've seen enough of this room. I can't okay. say less. Teacher, let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. Nah, say less. I, I'm about to see. So, where is Chloe? Wow, 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 wow. David, uh, Chloe is. is dead. This isn't happening. It can't. No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you Yes, I I saw her. I I saw a Jefferson killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room? Oh, he about to crash out, bro. He about to crash the I fuck out. I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it. You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker. You crash took out. away my stepdaughter. David, wait! Oh my God! See, I I knew, bro. I think I be I be watching movies. I be watching movies and shit, bro. Any real nigga is doing this, cause I'm saying I want him to go to jail from my standpoint, from me outside looking in type shit. But from like a parental, from a position of like actual care and compassion for somebody, you are gonna want to kill that person in that moment. You're not giving a fuck about nothing. You want you want justice served by you i think this is the reasonable real nigga way but as the player we go on with the first option we're gonna we're we gonna do the first thing because now david's in trouble as well so we can save him max he might not be in trouble though because this is like i'm sorry you know i'm sorry you had to see that not me where's the hole in his head 
I'm trying to what see the hole this? in his head. You what? What have I done? I don't think he gets in trouble for this. All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe, I'm sorry. Joyce, I failed you. My family. Now, nah, he a real nigga. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max, you better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, I... thank you for saving me. Please let me rewind this. Did I, what did I just do? Teacher. Just see looking at that makes me want to vomit. Shit all over this computer. You want, you want to know what made me want to vomit? Them little ass pockets, man. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. Look at you trying to, she trying to justify that debt. No, but Chloe's dead. Bro, Chloe, Nathan, Rachel. Freedom. Holy shit. That's it. This storm is real. I need to find more. Yes. Warren. Shit that never happens. Never mind. Listen. You have that photo you took last night in the parking lot. Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Bet. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thinks this Armageddon weather. Yeah, say less. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. Hang up. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think, the you think I'm afraid of a little rain? Kind of That's okay. Me too. I like when it's but wet. It's not over yet, Warren. So I like on. when it's wet. I like when it's wet. I like when it's wet. Choo -choo. I like when it's wet. Striking us down, and I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. <laughs> Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, goddammit, how do I pay all those taxes? You have one new message. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say. I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. I'm sorry. I, I mean, you got to feel a little bad for him because, you know, Nathan's Nathan's upbringing and just his mental state is not the best concoction for being able to make the best decisions, you know. But you always have a choice. You always have a choice, bro. Like shit just gets deeper and deeper and deeper and you know you willingly decide to keep digging that hole. You know what I mean? At a point. 
It's all gotta come to an end. This is the beginning of Resident Evil 2. Death is everywhere. It's following me. Help me! Damn! You dumb, dumb ass nigga. Oh, that's the homie from. See what I mean? Choices, bro. This is choices. Nigga had to get a picture. Kevin, did you see that tornado? Get the hell out of here. Max, there's no way I can pass up these images. Just look at it. Can't take a picture when you're dead. Now move your ass. Okay, this you insist. It's all over. Whoa, Max. You do know things. I can't believe such this an idiot. Real. Only if you don't buy the safe spot until it blows over. Okay? Now I better listen to the real everyday hero. Come with me. I have to help somebody else first. Hey, anybody else need help? You don't have to ask God. Is that Ashley up there? Man, look. Shit. I mean, Alyssa, okay. whatever. Same shit. Okay. See, normally, I wouldn't help her. But death is, that's a little crazy. That's a little crazy. Hold on, Alyssa. Take my hand. The running gag was good up until now. I get out of here. Call Warren. If we can make it out of this, Chloe. me so sad so he shit out of luck hey i know i'm not supposed to just cook this nigga you're talking about he in shock he about to be in some real shock yeah i get it it's been a long day my fault what's another death right <laughs> wake your punk ass up oh, this can't be the end come on you have to get out of here right now I need to breathe. Uh, I need Eric. No more storms. And what was you? S nice. You should get out of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over there. I need Warren's photo. Come on, man. We beelining it straight there, bro. Die. W. W. Die. Oh shit, what about that lady? 
shit. That lady did. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, she no did. No need to go there now. Wait, there's a fire heading this way. I need to do something about it. Oh first. shit! I didn't even see all that. Look at the ground. Just stand on top of it. Stand on business. Boom! I real life do not know what the fuck you want me to do. Oh, nigga, come on, man. Throw it on the gas. Yes. I wish life was back to simple eggs and bacon. This door is locked. Damn, this is blocked off. Now I have to find another way into the diner. I wonder where the other way is. Evacuation. Once again, this is not a test. This is not a At test. Least nobody's a going to starve in here. For Acadia Bay and surrounding counties. As a student of Blackwell, I'm torn writing this essay. I love my school and the education is provided, but at the same time, I have to use my own critical thinking abilities as a budding journalist. So when I report that Blackwell has a problem, it's not with any glee or agenda. In fact, this problem reflects a disturbing national trend. In short, there are bullies at school, and they are us. Max. Damn, so they just blew up in this bitch. Oh, Max. Oh, ho. Oh. Oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out I know. there. Okay, I wonder if you ever won the lottery. Inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. So Hello. glad everybody is safe here. Where's Chloe? Ah, oh, it's fucked. Joyce, how are you doing? Just when I think I've already been through the ringer. Where's Chloe? She's safe, Joyce. She just sent me a text before my phone died. Oh, thank God. I was torturing myself before you showed up. Oh, God, if something happened to Chloe while well, I ended up stuck at this diner again. I'm sorry about all this, Joyce. Yikes. Don't be, honey. It's not like you whipped up this tornado on your own. Um, I mean, yeah. I'm also sorry about everything with David. Yeah, not me. I ain't you did it. You don't have control over any of that. David is an adult, and he has a lot more age and experience under his belt. Even if he doesn't always show it. I think he ain't got no squabbles under his belt. I know that. I know. I just feel like everything that's going on with us is the perfect storm for Arcadia Bay. I just want our lives to be normal again. With all the shit going on this week, I think you're right. And look at me, trying to keep my family together again. Max, did I make a mistake kicking David out? Yes. David saved my life from the storm. I saw how much he cares about Chloe. Even if he couldn't show it, David needs you more than ever. And I can see why you love him. I'm so happy David was there for you. He has a lot of weight on his back from the war, but he truly wants to help people. He even agreed to take a family counseling class. I'm sure that was a hard thing for him to do. It shows how much he truly cares about you and Chloe. Nothing would make me happier than for David and Chloe to make peace, not war. But I don't know what to do anymore. She I just not alive right now. I just want this storm to blow over forever. Maybe it's time we leave Arcadia Bay, if we can. David is a real hero, Joyce. I know that all he wants to do is make you happy. I know he would do anything for you. And Chloe. I know. And yes, he's not William, but that's okay. He's not supposed to be. 
You reminded me of when he came into my life. I was ready to give up. David's love gave me strength. He even told me I was his hero. And I can't give up loving him. I wanted to come back home. Oh, I hope I get to tell him that soon. Yeah, I need that picture now. Please be okay. I hate to say I'm glad to see you, but I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. I can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh yeah, you're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you... This is our last resort, bro. We gotta get back Trust to that me, party. Okay? I always do. Crack down on you Jeffrey. probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa, is that all? I have to go back in time. Jefferson already killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. All oh, because, because of me? How? Butterfly I'm not a real effect, man. Even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. What happened with Jefferson? Did. Did he hurt you? I think it just believed me too. Damn. He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up and dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. When you're trying to hit. <laughs> I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. Couldn't let it just like just slide past me like that. I had to grasp it. Firmly grasp it. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Busted. History. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reversed or, or altered time, maybe you caused a chain reaction. Even in the environment. You're my friend, Warren. You believe me, right? I I haven't told anybody else except for Chloe and and she can't I'm help me right now. All right, what's in my pockets? Be a pain in the ass, <laughs> and, and you've always treated me like a person, not. I'm a beta nerd. I, I told you before that I'll always believe you. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max. I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? That's a good nigga, man. I'm in the middle of it with you. So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. It's a ride or die, my fucker. Warren is a rider that motherfucker. Hey, be careful out there. Wherever out there is. 
Oh shit, I gotta get a nigga a little smooch, bro. You know I gotta get a nigga a little smooch, Max. Get a little this, get a little. I don't got a, I don't got a lot left, but get some, get some Vaseline with cocoa butter. Mwah! Give me best, sir. For luck. He deserved that. That nigga almost just in died. Case we don't get out of this. <laughs> you saw him. I, say, I know, Lauren. Of course you. Bro almost died. He said, "I'm going to make the right choices from now on." I swear. That's why you're super max. I wanted to just leave for a split second just to. It would have been funnier. I ain't gonna lie, but. Uh... Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I got a lot better at the focus. Because I've had to do it seven times in this episode. See, the kiss don't even matter. Shit. Come on, Max. Chloe. Ugh. Chloe. And. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? You can tell her. I'm she knows. I'm just glad we're here together. You... I guess you need to talk. Bitch, you died! No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right you now. You died, bitch! I'm sorry, Maybe Warren. I to Rachel. Chloe, wait, listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. It's Jefferson. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. We saw the proof. Now, excuse me. I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? You know I have powers, bro. What? Nathan's dead. Nathan is dead. And you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan, and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. Chloe! Oh my god, bro. Man, she just won't listen. Chloe, you can't get revenge if you're dead. It doesn't matter. I have to make Nathan pay for what he did to Rachel. And I know you've got my back. Chloe! Damn, if that... I'm totally strong <laughs> and honest, she'll listen. They talking about be honest. Like, what, what else am I doing? Did I lie? Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm... I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No. Not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm going to do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is going to turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. We on a roll, y'all. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And you, you were ooh, in pain. You ooh, were slowly ooh, dying. Ooh, and 
fuck? You, you asked me to end your life. But Chloe, there was no way I could do that. I had to return to this timeline to see you again. I had to. God, Max. That must have been... Okay. That must have been awful for you. I didn't know how that was going to go. I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen. And as usual, I messed everything up. And I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? But what are we doing about Nobody the storm? The, the tornado. The thing is that we're together again. Right. That's that's why you should come with me so we can stay together. This shit got me stressed and out. Stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Absolutely of not. Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? Are you sure about get that? It. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. David was ahead of us. David saved me. David cares about you. Well, let's try X. Let's try Y first. Chloe, David saved me from Even Jefferson. I'm using a PlayStation controller. If he controller. didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you. But I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just... Explain that I traveled through time using oh, the photo. Oh, fuck. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Such a mind fuck. Let's see it. Okay. <laughs> that nigga. <laughs> So we're at the storm together now. So now what? Oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So how was your time trip, dude? Damn, that's a trip, bro. Oh, you're alive. You're alive, oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It this is what smoking salvia is like. You're with me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And you traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life. After all, my. Hey, are we doing this right here? Come on. Right now? I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. We should be on our way to you Wyoming or something. Caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We I thought that we she was gonna smack us. Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. 
for once I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look! The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is this, stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on that. Oh God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. Montezuma's revenge. Come on. Chloe. I've got your back, Rex. Literally. Like, I got that shit in my hand. Bro, what? Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm back in class. As he what the hell? Us. Bro, what? These pieces of time can frame us in our glory. And I'm have sorry. to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This From might be hell. Ah, now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed up. In black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Nigga, am I? Bueller. Diane Arbus. Be calm. I had to look around to Don't see where I was. Out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. Nah, what it you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers. Whoa, and what the f oh the purge! She saw humanity as tortured, right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares. Shh, shh, shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously oh, though, shit. I can frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you. Nah, nigga, this is a Sukiyomi, bruh. This is a fucking Sukiyomi. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Nah, this is making me feel like... Nah, I'm about to start dissociating right now. Oh, no. Rachel didn't deserve any of this. What the fuck? I'm in purgatory, bro. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Yeah, this is a Tsukiyomi. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. What the fuck? Like, what, our dark room? I like to think of it as our dark room. It's the only place I truly feel safe and protected from the storm. Of course, Max. I can capture you over and over. You can be my model for life. And death. We are going to be so happy together in the dark. Just make sure you stay pure. I won't like it if you get dirty like Rachel or Chloe. This can't be real. I don't believe it. Everybody's dead. Except Kate. She killed them all. Or this, this not, these, never mind. These not candlelight visuals. Is it? I don't, what is going on? Hey, Kate. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You never understood me, or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone. And that means I'll always be alone. Thanks to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. What the fuck? Don't flip! Yeah, I'm, I knew that's what that was going to be. This is... Cr I mean, like, obviously she wasn't going to get out of this unscathed. Nah, hell, bro. What the fuck are we doing? No way, dude. Like, I'm not about to... I'm not about to... I, I gotta go through the same door Kate went through. Psych. I gotta go through my door. Nigga, what? 
I gotta go through Victoria's door. I gotta go to the bathroom. This hall never ends. I, I better find something. What the fuck, bro? Key. 218. Okay. Boy, hit. Something changed. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, things are changing. 224. Shit. Oh, no, that's Kate's room. Fuck. Don't start me from the beginning. Now my room. It's a trip, bro. So you should be how he said you have your vets no scams again. I'm not going to do no rituals on me, bitch. Title screen plays. Music. That's my nigga, Iku. Take a picture, take a picture, take a picture. Oh, you're leading me. Where? The bathroom? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Don't try to hide, Max. Get over here. Let me capture you. Jefferson is coming after Max. me again. You no. used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. I'm not about to die, bitch. You about to die. Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. Okay, that's great. Oh, Max! What the fuck? How did a nigga do that? Nah, bro. What? Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. It's in the dark room. It's in the dark room. It's what happened to your spark, Max? I thought I could be your professor for life. I wish that I'd. Did, I couldn't have this moment for life. I realize now for you'll life. never be an artist. Damn. Much less a photographer. Come here, Max. Hey. You're so weird, bro. Like. Max! You used to be so Come on now, come on now, come on now, come on now. Now, you have to die. Shit. How I get over there, big bro? Okay. Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. Shit. Max. Bitch. What you, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What happened to your spark, Max? I thought I could be your professor. This is life. <laughs> Whoa. That's me. Blackwell, this is Principal Wells. And I'm here to drop the mic on Max Caulfield. What the fuck? Attention. I regret to announce no, 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 no. that we met. Attention. I regret to announce that one of your fellow classmates, Maxine Caulfield, Caulfield, Crawfield, 
Travis Caulfield. Remix. Fellow classmates, Max Caitlin Caulfield has died under tragic circumstances that I promise to in and after I get my drink on. Max, where are you? Max, come out to play. Come out to play. So you just gonna stand there? Hey, baby, who wants to go ape? Hurricane go Chris? Ape, go ape, baby. Only after this comes out. You dig my wheels, Max? Get in the car. I'll this take you for a ride. can't just show up at Blackwell in, in a car. wheelchair and think we're going to accommodate her every whim. For real? Do you have a scarf I can borrow, Max? Yeah. Fucking school up. You just use your Max, You're just life. jealous because and me and Victoria actually do the work. What? No, real shit. I'm super jealous. What is going on? Stop! Stone. You're just jealous because a pot Victoria a actually do junk. the work while you do nothing and Crazy lie. random ass words. A pothead! I'm gonna cut you open, freak. Max! She gave great pains. <laughs> Those were my beans, Max! Those were my fucking beans! Mighty beans. I'm sorry, bro. I didn't know those was your mighty beans. Bro. Max! Come back in the dark room. I know it's time for you to die. Oh, no. too. Bottles. This might be hell. Max, sit down. You're taking a time out no matter what. If this is my nightmare, let me have one sanctuary. your carcass next to wow. Rachel and do an epic photo shoot. Fuck you, Frank. Fuck a nigga named Frank. Fuck a nigga named Frank. Well, these ones aren't too hard to find. Psst. Max. Fuck a nigga named Frank. Looks like there's still bottles to find. Oh, joy. What are you talking about? I'm not finding bottles right now. I'm tweaking, bro. <laughs> I'm in a snow globe. Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here. What the I fuck? When your mom is away, I'll let her know that. <laughs> Damn, clue you out thick. Never mind, oh. she was like 12 right there. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast. Fuck am I talking about? Max. We're all going to work at the two wins. It was a joke, you know? What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Do I have to watch this? Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the safe mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to You are ridiculous. Tomorrow. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Aha, you can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave, play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tastings. Hey Max, would you say hi to Chloe and Joyce? Don't forget to remind me that. Oh. I, I, knew, I knew it was going to be something, but it threw me off in the beginning. Don't forget to remind them that you let me die. Max, this is your old pal Chloe. You left in a wheelchair in another reality. Did I thank you before you bailed to a new life? Not only did you blow off my request, you already jumped into another, another photo. How many fucking times can you abandon me, hippie? Pompadou is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, do not mess with Frank or me. You got a snack? 
you, you, you got a snack. Good evening, young Max. The squirrels talk to me, but how can you? Samuel has no phone. Hi, Max. Rachel Amber here. Just wanted to introduce myself. I'll be seeing you soon, real soon. Max, I loved your photo shoot with Jefferson. He absolutely captured you. If you want, we can hang out and get high. Wow. Dad. This is fucking purgatory. How long will oh. this nightmare go what on? What the fuck? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Hold on, bruh. Max is a fucking child. Oh, Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? Oh. I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell so is So she's over Victoria Max. now. Let's prove it. Holy shit, Warren. Max is trying to play us both. Guess she's not as innocent as she acts. Not when she's trying to hook up with both of us. I only want to go ape with you, Chloe. Come here. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. Chloe! I hear that? Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh shit, look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Damn, you a fucking a thought. Max. I fucking love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. Damn, floozy. Fucking I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. The fucking treesh. Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Whoa. Rachel's dead and you're still alive. Whoa. Life is so not fair. I wish she would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to be saying. I'm trying to figure this shit out, y'all. It's, 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 it's beyond me. Ah, shit, it's like, damn. Oh my god, bro. Great, numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? I'm not, you're not going to. Oh, wait. Nope. Uh, I'm gonna be in this bitch forever. No. Why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Oh, sh I was just about to say it's 0311. Don't kill us, Max. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. That nigga's doing a mannequin challenge. And now, all of my customers? <laughs> What's wrong with you, Max? I can't believe you kissed me. Now you're going to kill me? Max, please save us. Honey, I save always the big foots, Max. Like a please. So this and is how Max gets her revenge off. From my family. Breaker, breaker. Thanks you're for saving me. me. So I know I haven't I been, been the best friend to you. We'll have to but go without you've been me. Don't let the squirrels die. Y'all fucking a new baby. We'll Don't let the squirrels me. die. Who are you? This nigga, all, Don't all let he, the squirrels die. All he care about the Don't squirrels. Don't let the squirrels die. I heard you. I thought you were one of the few people I could trust at Blackwell. I don't know why you thought I that. Thought, who, who are you? Holy shit, are you serial? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers. I tried to. It really wasn't my choice. It wasn't my choice. I didn't ask to rewind time. No, but you were happy to use it to get people to like you. <sighs> As if you cared about them. Is this some like big self realization? Like, I don't. I do care. You do care. Like, I don't care about all the people that I helped, but. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. 
by telling people what they want to hear? Mm, okay, I see. You were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends, and I've used my powers for good. Please, stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> I was trying to say, I was literally going to say what that. what about Frank? That bullet in him wasn't your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? We all are. This isn't about Chloe, or even me anymore. Gosh, you're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you'll have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she has any Even if you make us? it out of this, how do you ever return You're to normal? You're just another puppet. Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... For the rest oh, of your life, you're about to have a, a 10 million yard stare... Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. I didn't expect Fast all this. I really didn't. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. Not like this, at least. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Are my eyes getting darker? Yes, of course it's- This song fucking rules. Oh. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Ra and Ra. You saved me again! Crazy! Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'm so glad you're my now partner. Now they went crazy time. on this episode. As long as you're my partner in time, I might get. Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a drawing. Cowabunga! Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my- Photobomb! Photo hop. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. It's weird hanging out with you again. All of these are just mixing in. Oh, awesome picture. We look so Chloe! You're back. Kate wasn't the first. Can't have multiple realities at the same time. <laughs> oh, Rachel, no, no, please not her. Come on, Max, we're oh, almost, Max. There. almost there. Max, come on now. Come on now. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Chloe, I, I must have passed out. Oh, Sorry. thank God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. So what are we going to do? Jump into the eye of this shit? 
We gotta shoot an arrow this is into my it. storm. I caused this. I caused all of this. I changed fate and destiny so much that I actually did alter the course of everything. And all I really created was just death and destruction. Fuck all of that, okay? You were given a power. You didn't ask for it. And you saved me, which had to happen. All of this did, except for what happened to Rachel. But without your power, we wouldn't have found her. Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield. Here he is. And you're amazing. Max. This is the only way. I feel like I took the shot a thousand years ago. Again? You... You could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to... to... Fuck that. No. No way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. This is the final decision. You proved that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... My stepfather... Deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Don't say that. I won't trade you. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died True. around you. True. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish for once. I think I should You're accept true. my fate. Our fate, Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, in whatever reality, all those moments between us were real, and they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, I know you'll make the right decision. Chloe. I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. Uh, the fucking answer is... Uh, we gotta sacrifice her, bro. We have to sacrifice her. Like sacrificing the entire town for her because she made a very good point with her saying with her mentioning about the amount of times that she's had to be saved. I don't know if her having to be saved is because she was a little more reckless because she knew I had the power. But like that's just in her nature and nature is what's been affected by this because the tornado you get what I, you get what I'm saying. Nah, nah, I'm bullshit on that, but no real shit like. And even in the other reality, she in it, like I said in the last episode, like it's just in your blood for this to happen. Like that's your destiny. That's the whole point of this is destiny, right? You can't fuck with fate. You can't play God. She has to be sacrificed. Chloe, Chloe. Sacrificing the entire town for her too is like, how do you live with that? How do you live with either one of these decisions as Max? But being Chloe, see, nah, cause knowing Chloe, knowing Chloe, if we sacrifice Arcadia Bay and she knows it, it was at, at the expense of her, she gonna kill herself anyway. Chloe! Max, it's time. Chloe, I'm so, so sorry. I, I don't wanna do this. I know, Max, but we have to. We have to save everybody, okay? 
and you'll make those fuckers pay for what they did to Rachel. Being together this week, it was the best farewell gift I could have hoped for. You're my hero, Max. See, damn, that's... Okay. Uh... That's crazy in every... In every reality... Chloe's wish was for me to be the one to, to do I'll this. I'll always love you. Now get out of here, please. Do it before I freak. And Max Caulfield... Don't you forget about me. Never. Don't you forget about me. Do, 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 do. This is serious. Back to the, the, the throw up eating butterfly. Butterfly effect? Obvious, huh? So you're about to just watch her get sh What the fuck? So you telling me I played five episodes when it could have been ha just half a one? Not even half a one? We could have... We didn't even it's have... It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't we didn't even have to bond or nothing. Come to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. Mm. You got hella cash. Yeah, she. This was. You this, don't know who the fuck I am. Her destiny was to around. die here. Where'd you get that? Like, I know we know that what already. What are you doing? Like, Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Fuck. See, because that was the initial... This was the initial fate that we changed. Like the first major one other than like the stupid like questions in class. Damn. Now this deep. In reality, he would have seen me. He would have seen me because how you shoot somebody and you don't check the whole bathroom. You don't check the whole bathroom. Damn, she with Rachel now and her father. Maybe. I nah, come on, bro. Okay, cool. I was gonna say like Fuck, bro. Joyce life is so ass. I ain't gonna lie, they did they shit on this. They did they shit. Funeral? Alright, she's just wearing black.
See, the reason why I like this is because they were able to convey the message like very, very well. I mean, if you're paying attention. She got the little deer, little bust down deer. 40 karat gold. It's not like they were just doing a bunch of nothing. Like all that other mind fuck shit that we were doing w within the alternate realities and shit. They weren't just doing that to do it. Like it all had a purpose and it was being conveyed well. Okay, so it was a uh, funeral. So did Kate go through what she had to go through? I just got to commit to the copyright because there's no way I do this with no, you know, it ruins the whole thing. Nah, when Max shows up, I'm finna cry, bro. <laughs> Wait a minute. David Daughter, the Shapur Duder, Papa Duder. Hold on now, what was that little glitch? sign man hell no now see i didn't know what i was getting into like i liked i was i was enjoying the game but i needed some more like substance to that shit and that's exactly what i needed that scratched my itch for that i ain't gonna lie that was cool that was a good game i liked it shout out to uh who made this don't nod everybody on this list y'all did that shit bro other than the little, you know, the little bugs we had. What's the final? What's the results? What's the results? Y'all niggas is. Like, I get it, though. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. But fit, damn. Nigga said, fuck everybody. I don't know them niggas. <laughs> Bro, I feel it. I feel it. I think mine was the more realistic thing. Sacrificing the whole city is kind of devilish. I ain't going to. That's, that's heinous. 56% of people need to see a therapist probably, but it's cool. I'm standing on it. I'm standing on that, bro. Standing on that shit, bro. Shit. Damn. Man. Wow. After that last episode, if two is better for real, we're going to have to see about that. If you guys enjoyed this, please let me know. Make sure you... <laughs>
hit that like button i have to say that because the thing it lights up i didn't know that the thing lights up when you say hit that like button let me know how you feel about this what is your uh your takeaway your synopsis your evaluation of the whole thing with that being said y'all i appreciate y'all for even watching these and just being here with me and allowing me to express and create in y'all face like this gay <laughs>